Welcome back! This is Pine Leaf Needles, and we're about to start Sector 4. So let's jump. Next sector. And we have a choice between a Zoltan controlled sector and a slug controlled nebula. Yes, the slugs like controlling nebulae. So we will go towards the Zoltans. And maybe we could pick up a Zoltan crew member. Of course, one advantage perhaps of having go of going through the nebula is I might pick up a slug crew member and that could help to fill out my crew list but for now we'll head towards the Zoltans You've entered Zoltan territory. This species is not renowned for giving anything for nothing, but you can always be assured a fair hearing. It is not renowned for giving anything for nothing. Okay, so don't expect any free lunches here. And apparently there is nothing here. Apparently there's nothing in the first area you jump to, I guess. So what are my choices? A store right away. And the exit's way up here. If you hit the store, you get hit up here. Ah. Oh, right. We'll make Fleet pursuit slower, but will disrupt your sensors. Right. So therefore, this is going to be a tough one. The store. Then go up here, but this is pretty much a dead end. So I'm going to have to go to the store, jump back up to the ship, and back here, then up here, up here, up here. And we got all these nebula spaces. So apparently some parts of the nebula extend into this sector here. But we may be able to... So... Okay, he... Then I can go up here, out of the nebula, there, out of the nebula. There's a second nebula. Heck, so I have to go into... A big jump here and here. And that will be my path. So do I have time to go to the store in all this? Well, I really wish this were able to connect up to here because... Oh wait! I can avoid the nebula here, to here, to here, to here, to here, to here, to here. Alright, so I do have a southern path I can take. Good, so I'll go to the store. Azoltan are fascinated by other species and have set up something of an alien knick-knack shop here. Why not take a look? Yes, let's take a look. So therefore, we've got drone system, system repairs, and anti-personnel. Well, first of all, let's fix. I'm going to need some fuel. System repair drone. Now I can only have, looks like I can only have two up at the same time. Now that might be because I need to upgrade before I can get more drones in there. That's going to be my best guess on the matter. Let me close this for a moment. Look at my ship. And on a ship for upgrades. Let's see. Powers all the ship's drones. Drones are automatic robots perform tasks, right? And looks like all the upgrades just add more potential power you can have to drones.
So if you have three, well, I'm guessing that you can have more drones than, but that's an, that's just a guess at the moment. No, that's not what I meant to do. I want to, all right, back at the store. It's always difficult to get... Well, I'm no longer in an area threatened by mantis. So I'm going to go by the assumption I'm not going to need to... Nah, I don't need a system repair drone. That would just be... Let me just get the last... Th there. I seem to be using quite a number of missiles. And it was a very good bargain for me to sell drone parts there. That was more of a humanitarian effort, I guess. <laughs> and we'll close that for now. Optimal play obviously means I should have ignored that bargain. Very well, let us head on. Oh, there's another store here! <laughs> right. Well, I don't have enough to buy at this store. Well, what did I want to do here? Because this, oh, right, that just leads me back down here anyway. Oh, wait a minute. Did I mess up completely? Oh, that's right. I was going by the assumption that I could go from here. Somehow I got myself down to that. Yeah. That was a very bad assumption I made there. Somehow I thought that there was a path out of here, but there isn't. So that southern path is not really existing. So I must go back up here to this unpossible ship here. That little side trip. A ship with the pirate markings demands your surrender. It is sad times when even Zoltan's base is beset by pirates. You doubt these fools will be missed. Uh, probably not. What do they have on them? Just standard weapons. Nothing too dangerous, probably. So therefore, what am I going to do? I guess my usual plan... take out their weapons as quickly as possible and then try to yeah okay I got it what I'll do is we will do that and go on our way and give myself a defense drone. Yeah. I'm not getting too much on them, am I? Let's see. Actually... Enemy ship seems to be powering its FTL. It is trying to escape. So we are going... Well, the weapons are down anyway, so... They offer you to give you some of their goods if you don't destroy their ship. Pirates? Nah. Anyway, <laughs> I had already fired the shots. I couldn't. <laughs> the ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection. Right. Three fuel, a missile. Well, I spent a lot of missiles, though, for that missile. And 36 scrap. The 36 scrap will come in handy, I am sure, at some point. So now... Right. I really have to come up here. Up here. So I am... Yes, or right, here's a...
possible ship detected, and it's in the nebula. This is going to be real. Fun. The nebula turns out to be the hiding place of a terrified rock crew taking refuge from the Zoltan border police. They don't seem to prepare to risk your leaving without with their coordinates. They open fire. All right, I'm not too familiar with the rock. But apparently they can get paranoid at times. So therefore, since they're mainly worried about killing me, I presume they're probably not going to try to flee, so therefore I am going to go after their weapon systems. Oh, they've got quite a lot of shields here. Actually, chain, let's take out their shields instead. Let's see what happens. Alright, what have we got here? Yes, unfortunately, it's hard to see what's going on due to the activ due to the activities of the nebula. I need well, okay, if the sensors are in trouble, therefore I will send Emma into the oxygen wing. I need to be able to repair the drone. Oh, I don't have my drones up, don't I? Well, I'm going to have to turn on my drone. Alright. Alright, I'm starting to get through them. The idea is now... That should be enough on their shield, so... Yeah, their shields are currently down, so let's see if I can... take out their weapons. Alright. The rock ship moves into a defensive position and transmit white flag signal. They're willing to buy their lives, accept their offer, and then not accept it. Now, these are not pirates. They're just hiding away, and they're trying to save themselves. So I will accept their surrender in this case. Very well. That ends the fight. And now... Let me get out of this nebula. Yeah, we're starting to get the first signs of the rebels here, but fortunately I am about to head off this time, avoiding the nebula. You arrive at a Zoltan research facility. They say that they are researching genetic distortion due to stasis sleep and prolonged FTL drive. They ask if your crew has time to undergo a few scans. All right, let's see what happens if I do this. Your crew calmly lines up for the Zoltans to take their readings. After a short time, the process is done. They contact you. Thank you for your participation. Please accept these small cakes made from stiff dough as well as some scrap. Well, that was it. All right. Uh, nothing drastic happened there. I was... Hmm, it would be nice, actually, before I do anything here. No store in the area. It would be nice if we get a store here, because if I am See, that's here, that's fine. It's this location that's going to be the troublesome spot. But after that, we'll be free and clear. And supposedly, the rebels will be slowed down a little bit from the nebula. So I should be able to survive. So let us head on to... Yeah, I'm there. Over here. But before we do that, any upgrades I want. 
Well, that uh, refills oxygen faster. All right. Well, that would be nice. It would be nice if I... No, we don't really need... What do I have here? The only thing I don't have is the transporter. The only thing not powered. It's not an important system to have powered at the moment. We will save the scrap for now, just in case I do find a store. Maybe I can get that cloaking device. You catch a glimpse of a strange signal coming from a space station before your sensors shut off unexpectedly. As you discover that your sensors are being jammed, you hear hostiles beam onto your ship. Right. Okay. Time to power up a defensive drone. There's Rebecca. There is Lauren. Markel. All right. Yeah. We'll move Emma into here also. All right. And well, there's no room for her. Oh, okay. It's, I guess that's marked. Let's see. I gotta make sure everybody is. Oh, okay. There's my drone. I guess I could add a little bit more here. Oh, Rebecca needs to head to the med bay. Let's see. Okay. Emma is going to switch out. Markel will switch in. Jill switch out. Have to do a little bit more micromanaging on the boarding actions. Oh, Markel switch out. Emma switch back in. getting in trouble. <laughs> ah! I was too slow there. What's going on in there? Oh, they're taking out my weapons. Oh, we've got four enemies in there. Markel has to go back in here. Rebecca, go back into there. There are a lot of enemies here. What happens if I jump while this fight's going on? I don't know, but I have a feeling I'm not going to be in a good shape if that happens. If we're to a store location, I probably would try it. Okay, Mafon has to go here. Markel can come back in here. Alright, looks like... What's the drone doing in here? Oh, the drone went back to the drone area. All right. I wonder if I can get the... I 
Right, okay, so therefore... Okay, Rebecca is already in the weapons area, that's fine. She's my last human, so I can't afford to lose her. Markel to the web to the to there. Jill. Actually, I see Jill's better at the engines. So therefore, Markel is just a general repair person. So take Markel to the shields. Jose is the pilot still there. And Mafan is going to have to take over here for now. All right, we're going to have to do that for the moment. Everything is f all right. We have slight trouble there, 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 there. There's nothing still to upgrade, so I want to see if I lose the drone power because it's uh, on the ship. Do I get to keep it? Now, unfortunately, I have to go into a nebula next. As you wait for your FTL to charge, you half expect the ambush at be ambushed in a minute. However, no attack comes. <laughs> oh well. Actually, oh, Jill. Jill's just. I didn't realize Jill needed a little healing here. Alright, now I'll send her back to her post. Alright, now. 90. Okay, now Rebecca. Let's get them all back to 100, 100, 100, 100. All right, everybody's now nice and fine. And I think that's the last time I have to be... All right. Okay. Now... There's a distress signal here. One, two, three. Yes, they're going slowly through the nebula area. Here's a distress signal. Up here, up here. That's three jumps. I should have time for a three jumper. The cockpit lights up with the warning signal. Oh, your cockpit lights up with warning signals. You are being targeted by a nearby ship. The distress call was a lure to attract unwitting ships into their weapons range. Be prepared to fight. That is evil. Very well. What do we... In, uh, that seems... That seems to be rather typical. So, therefore... Oh, I guess as soon as I take off power to that. Not enough system power. Alright, so as long as I've got that... Oh. This is not good. I can't get a defensive drone up because I still have an anti-personnel drone up. I'll probably have to do a few ship upgrades then in order to get around that little problem because I would rather have a defensive drone at the moment. Now how am I going to handle that? Is there a way to... I guess I can't turn that off. Oh, there we go. Alright, now I've got that. So now, 
we've got the Oh well, yeah, they've got a lot of... All right, first round I'm going to have to go against their shields. Hopefully that's enough in order to disrupt them a bit. The day is yours. Show your honor by allowing us to leave with our lives. Hmm. Well, I guess we will. Since they appeal to the sense of honor, I guess I'll accept it in that case. Very well, that is that. Of course, now I have to give up that drone. Actually, why they appeal to honor when they had a dis fake distress signal, I don't know. But All right, let's go here. A Zoltan ship makes contact. The nature of the day is rotational. The fever is emaciated. The reason is they're caught by some nasty deep space dementia. Before you can consider finding help for them, they open fire. Right. Okay. Some insane, a little bit of insanity there. see pretty heavy missiles pretty heavy shields there and a rather strong hull weapons I don't know what they have on that now I'm gonna have to take out their shields obviously Hopefully that'll help me to get through this. And oh, they got lots. Okay, yeah. I am going to put. I see three weapons there. <laughs> That's a pretty big enemy. Why did I turn on an anti personnel? I didn't want to turn on anti personnel. I went to defense. I really knew. <coughs> Ooh. Did that do anything? Let me check. That was act completely ineffectual against them. So I'll ha have to continue my way. <laughs> Right, I've got fires here. Alright, let's send Mothman to do some firefighting. I don't think the drone can do any. Besides, I think the drone only does fighting. Alright, for now we'll do that, and... Okay, we'll also do that. So we'll send a few people to fight some fires, see if that does anything. Oh, I lost... Oh, I've got ions on me. Oh, they've got an ion beam. Not completely sure what an ion beam does, but it's obviously not help good for my health. Or for my systems. 
Yeah, they're... Oh, their shields are down. Let me get those weapons as fast as possible. Hopefully I get a window here. All right, now, looks like the fire is out. Good. Everything seems to be here. I took some hull damage. And I am going to have... Their shields are down still, but I'm going to have to keep them down. And let's see. Yeah, that'll be a good way to go. Alright, that took care of them. Ship explodes, yes, and I got fuel. Alright, that's good. Missiles, I spent quite a few. And some good scrap. Good. Now, let's see what happens here. Okay, that's over with. So we'll go here, oops. Well, we will continue any... Ooh, I might be able to get that cloaking system. So I am going to save this scrap. And not do any upgrades at the moment. You've arrived at the Long Range Beacon! Yes, of course, but do I survive this encounter I'm about to have? Small merchant ship messages you. Underground Federation comm channels are all take, talking about your secret mission. Let us install a weapon to help. Good luck. Scrap 27 and a heavy laser mark 1. That's nice. Heavy Laser Mark 1. What does a Heavy Laser Mark 1 do? Requires 1 power. Causes 2 damage with low chance of fire breaching. This is fires 3 lasers, 1 damage each. This fires 1 shot that causes 2 damage. Right. So I will need one more power for that. Not enough. S oh, that's right. I also have to upgrade the system itself. Yes. So therefore, weapon system. All right. Now, if that, if I understand that right. Good, and I still have enough power for one drone. I only have one drone part left. Ooh, that's not good. So I'm going to need to get quite a few things next time at a store. Oh, and I need to heal up Markel. Jose took a little damage also. Okay, you need a... Jose's back here, so... Get him back into the jump position. Mon Fong is okay now. And Markel is back to normal. Alright, so now we are in a position where we can do our jump, which will be in our 
next episode where we will jump to the next sector into sector 5 and I think somewhere in sector 5 is where I'm able to unlock another ship I will find that out as if that's if that happens when I enter it or do I have to get all the way through it but until then this is Pine Leaf Needles Mayor Shields protect you and your weapons never break <laughs>